after you've been set free Après que vous libre, go help your friends to be free and take them out of bondage push your wife now uh-huh. Speak to the demon that 
is holding your husband, maybe it's pornography. Tell it the demon, we cannot share this man. And the spirit will leave. It will go. God works when we apply faith. But you don't pray to a mountain, you speak to the mountain. How do you speak to the mountain? You got to be under the anointing and revelation. Or else you're just going to be speaking your words. You speak to the mountain with the word of God anchored in you. When you're embedded in Him, and unleash those words, and not your words, it'll be God's word. The mountain will go away. Somewhere, somewhere. You have to be in Christ. Last point. Our testimony carries the weight. And we have to keep it. You have to know who Jesus is. The reality of Christ. What Jesus did for us. There's a time I had to teach about that for a long time. Who is this man called Jesus? Every time I teach about that revelation. Life and comfort resurrection. Is that reason why today in America most preachers have become motivational speakers? There. Now I, I pray you this clip goes to television. Watch this. Most preachers, if you're watching me, they have become motivational speakers. They're more sensitive to the people's needs and people's desires and not what the Lord wants. So that they will lure away from seeking God for revelation to speak God's agenda and plan and idea. And then in the feeling that it was selfishness to influence them, to give, to influence them, to be part of the organization so that they will accumulate a big following through falsity. Follow me here? Because people cannot be set free from falsity, they only set free from the truth, by the truth, from bondage. So falsity cannot set go free from bondage, is the truth. So when people begin to despite the ideas that become motivational speakers, so they can sell books and tapes, and get everybody to buy their books and tapes, and they lack the revelation, which can release people from chains. And remember, God is not popular on earth. Oh, yes, he's not famous. The earth has more than six billion people, I guarantee you, more than four billion don't even know who Christ is. So we have a lot of work to do. My vision is to reach two billion souls before the Lord returns. God will. I'm glad it's for Jesus for that. I believe in, I believe in reaching two billion souls. I believe that I can reach them not in my strength but the Lord's strength. And they will accept Christ. So this is not a chicken vision. This is not some little chicken vision. Some say, okay, we're going to own a satellite. Some say, amen. Very soon we're going to own a own satellite. Beaming the gospel to every part of the world, every continent, to every home, in the name of Jesus, to every household. Some of us it will be translated to every language. I speak that in the name of Jesus. It will be translated to different languages, and it is going to go to the nations, it is going to go to every household. God is in control. 